was lucky enough to play for Australia and go to China and Argentina, so those are like experiences I'll never forget. But I think I just play basketball because my brothers played it and I just wanted to like join in like them and just have fun. But then, yeah, I tried out for a few state teams and was lucky enough to get in those and then got a bit higher as it went on. So yeah, it started to get pretty serious pretty quick, yeah. For the state comps, I went to Melbourne and um, like Gold Coast and stuff like that and then was lucky enough to play for Australia and go to China and Argentina, so those are like experiences I'll never forget. There's something I always thought about because I knew I'd have to choose like, at some point, so like, it would always be on my mind sometimes, but um, like, it kind of came to me um, at one point, I just knew that like, footy was the right thing for me and um, that was my number one passion back then and still is, so yeah, I haven't really looked back at basketball, yeah. Well, I was kind of known as like a hustle and rebounder player in basketball, and um, yeah, I'd always be going for rebounds and hitting bodies, so um, I would always use second jumps and stuff like that as well, so um, that's something I use in footy as well, and um, but I think the follow-up side of footy, um, that's kind of helped as well, and um, yeah, that's probably one of my main strengths too. We're still pretty competitive, I guess. Like we both like to go at each other, but um, like he's been there um, like every step of the way with me, and um, like he's probably one of my best supporters as well. So um, we're always there for each other and stuff. So yeah, it's been really good. Yeah. Um, so obviously, hopefully, get on a list, and um, yeah, I just want to get stuck into it straight away, and um, yeah, try complete a whole pre-season and train really hard. Um, like it would be good to have an impact straight away, but. Um, if it takes longer for me, I understand that.